Whether we're talking about safety helmets or hard hats, both are designed to protect against concussions, cuts, and bruises, and traumatic brain injuries, or TBIs. OSHA requires employers to provide workers with head protection in areas where these injuries are possible. The Labor's Health and Safety Fund recommends head protection to be worn at all times on all work sites. No matter what head protection you are using, a good fit is essential. When choosing protective headgear, it must comply with ANSI's Z89.1 standard for industrial head protection. If your helmet follows the ANSI standard, you can be sure it also complies with OSHA's standards. You can check to see if your hard hat or helmet complies by looking inside the headgear for one of these designations. If you choose a hard hat, proper assembly is crucial to ensure that it provides the maximum protection. Make sure the inside suspension and shell are included. Inspect the parts of the hard hat, including any attachments that are included. Flip over the shell and install the inside suspension by applying the tabs in the suspension lugs. Once all of the suspension tabs are in place and secure, put on the hard hat and adjust the suspension strap. Check that the hard hat suspension is not too tight or too loose. Also ensure the crown strap suspension is seated on the top of the head. If the hard hat is manufactured for the shell brim to be forward, be sure it's worn in that direction. Regularly check to make sure your head protection is in good condition. Let your employer know if it needs to be replaced. Replace your hard hat when its expiration date has passed. Hats worn every day should be replaced every two years. For more information on head protection in construction, contact the fund's OSH division. Thank you and stay safe out there.